I got a where's the controller the TV so I can see somebody chats. Is it already muted? Yeah. Stumble's family gathering. I can't see what you... I can see you all there typing. Hello, JB. Hello, Amber. It ain't on TV yet. Hello, Boris. Hello, Donnie. Oh, it's popping up now on the screen. There's Scott and Randy. I can see y'all now. I couldn't see it a minute ago. Kim is... It is 71. Hello, Bob. Hello, Oscar. It is 71 in this house right now. And Kim is cold as all get out. And you know me, I'm burning up. I'm drinking ice cold water. I'm burning up. Kim's, Kim's, uh, cold. And here I am burning slap up. 71 degrees. Uh, it has been raining nonstop. I'll take you outside. Matter of fact, I better take you outside now, ain't I? Is it raining, Kim, or no? Stop. I'll take you outside now. I'll take you outside. I can't read you. Hello, Jeff. Hello, Boris. I'll take y'all outside. I'll tell y'all a little bit about what I did this week. So, what have we been doing this week here at the Stumbo household? We have been digging more. So, as you see, we got it all dug. Look at it down through there. Look at it. It's all dug all the way down. All dug all the way down. And had to get a new, if you don't see anything here on me back yet, had to get a ladder today. I decided on this ladder. Why? Because it's one of the cheapest ones there. $199 plus tax. But it's 14 foot. This thing extends, if y'all know anything about the little giants. You can make this thing one, one big tall ladder. and uh, Or it can be a, a uh, oh my goodness, Whew. step ladder. It can be a step ladder or and it extends out as a step ladder so it can go you just you press in those you turn those knobs right here i'll turn it let me get you up there and it'll extend out but anyway 14 foot ladder i had to get another one because uh those little cheap ladders like that one down there that I have, it broke. And uh, your buddy here has got some scrapes from it. A few little cuts, but nothing, nothing serious. But I had to get a ladder. So it's $200 for a ladder. But anyway, got this done. Got all it dug out. Uh, what else? Did, oh, I poured concrete today before the, because I knew the rain was coming. Let me flip you back around. So I poured concrete today. And I didn't buy enough bags. As you see that big hole that's there, I need about three, three more bags to fill it up of concrete. So I need about three more bags. 
only got one bag. Need about three more bags. So there's that. I'll take you over here. Feed the garden. I'll also tell you a story. I almost died last night. Last night was the closest I have been in a few years to dying. Uh, but I'll tell you all that when I go inside. Anyway, I planted cucumbers because I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I know it's early that I'm planting cucumbers. I'm hoping that they grow and then by August, I can plant again. And then October, I can, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get extra. But if these don't grow, it's fine. I'm, I'm planting a month in advance here on cucumbers. So that's, but I don't care because there's, I've got, I've got enough, cu I've got three packs of cucumber seeds and uh, I, I didn't even use a quarter of the first pack to plant one hill. All I've got is two little hills. But anyway, I'll turn you around and show you the garden. So I planted the first hill over here. I still got that hill. I, it isn't planted. I'll plant it regularly. I just want to see if I can do it is basically what I did. I just want to see if I can do it. If I can't do it, it's fine. Uh, because before I plant that hill, it'll be like a month from now. But anyway, look at all the lettuce. So the lettuce is planted, and it's all coming up. As you see, it's doing good. I planted the onions, too. You see the onions. And I've already got, like, kind of, you can see the hose where I'm going to plant. The reason I did that is kind of see how many tomato plants I need and how many pepper plants I need. So that's the reason I kind of did the hose, just to see. But I've already got the onions planted. And I've got more onions than that. And there's a few little lettuce coming up there, but I didn't plant it. They just wind blew it. But anyway, look at all the lettuce. There's a ton of it. So I did all that. If him, oh, if anybody's wondering, here, let me, let me peek you around the fence. If anybody's wondering what we do with the dirt, just in case you ever wonder what we do with the dirt, I'll peek you around the fence. We pour it over the hill there. You see the dirt? We just kind of go and dump it up and dump it over the hill. So there's that. I took Hunter the other day down there at the bottom of the hill to drive the Ranger. Oh, oh, I'll tell you something else I did too. I put slime. I put slime in that tire. That tire keeps going down. I don't know why that tire keeps going down. I don't know if it's in the rim. I don't know if I, I couldn't find, I can't find a hole in it. I don't know if it's in the rim. I don't know if it's in the valve stem. I don't know why. Now I put a can of fix flat in it and it worked pretty good, but it didn't fix it. It still had a slow, slow, slow leak. Now, before I put the fix flat in it a couple weeks ago, it was going down on me uh you could fill it up to 15 pound and in two days it would be on zero it'd be plumb flat on the ground so you basically had to fill it up every day and the reason you filled it up every day because you didn't want it to go flat on the ground because you didn't want it, the tire to pop off the rim uh so uh i got a can of fix flat tried that uh like I said, about two weeks ago, it still is going down a little bit. So I got a can of slime, and I took Hunter. Let me go. Let me walk back up. May I don't know if the little Hunter said looked like a racetrack. I don't know if it's a racetrack or not, but it kind of did the other day when, once he mentioned it. Let me go on the porch here. Uh, I don't think you can see it. You can't. You can't see it like it was the other day. You can see a little bit, like if I zoom in, you can see, you see it? So anyway, I took him and made a little thing. If y'all don't know, Hunter's 15, so he's gonna get to drive at 16. I just showed him some things. He noticed I'd drive the Ranger, but I wanted to show him some things for, you know, turn him loose on the actual vehicle. And I did Amber the same way. Just told her some things like, when you go around, the, you know, slow down before you go in a curve. That's kind of, you know, a curve kind of like down there. Slow down way before here. You know, don't don't speed going into the curve. Slow down well before you get to the curve. 
And then once you're coming out of the curve, you can, you know, hit the gas. Stuff like that. And just, you know, how to stay consistent on your... That's the one biggest problem is, you know, the stopping and starting. You just want to stay consistent. But anyway, we're down there. Well, guess what comes out? The dogs. Again, of course. So the lady comes out. The lady comes out and she hollers at me. Hey, is them dogs bothering you? I didn't answer because I'm already... I'm, I'm already, I'm like, you know, y'all understand. And then she said it again. And like I said, she's an older lady. And so I had to check myself and be like, okay, don't, don't get my head. Just, you know. So I said, yes, ma'am. And I was very, very polite. I said, yes, ma'am. And she said, is them dogs bothering you? And I said, yes, ma'am. She said, do they still bother you? And I said, yes, ma'am, every day. Every single day, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And she was like, okay, I'll get rid of it. I was like, thank you, ma'am. That'd be appreciated. You know? So I know people ask me about the update on the dog situation. So there's, there's the, uh, there's the, uh, there's the ditch situation, the dog situation, Hunter's driving situation, the garden situation. There's all that. Also, going to get in the truck, going to get in the thing today. We took the truck. Do y'all remember when the truck just stopped? I told y'all it was computer, and there was something in it. It was a wire, wiring or something. Uh. Uh. Yeah, and that's the cheapest one, Mike. 200 for a ladder, and that's the cheapest one. Mike, my, I have to have one at least eight foot because my house is, uh, is 11 foot from the bottom of my house to the top to the gutter. So it needs to be eight foot I can reach up there because, you know, if, well, if you're five foot tall and you're standing on, not really standing on the top. You don't want to do that. You want to stand on the second. But anyway, well, I'm almost six foot. I'm close to six and five, but you all see what I'm saying. So anyway, um, yeah, in order to get like a 10 foot ladder, uh, and that one's 14 foot when you extend it all the way out. But uh, yeah. One, it does. Now, here's the thing, too. I didn't, I didn't even, I, I've never looked on the ladder for a weight limit. I didn't even, I've never looked on the ladder for, but there are weight limits. Uh, there are weight limits on, uh, on ladders. And so you can't just buy a ladder that's for, uh, you can't just buy a ladder for a, uh, you know, a hundred pound person, or most of the ladders are 200 pounds. Well, I'm a little above that. And, you know, that's probably, you know, due to that and being 25, 30 year old and the rust and uh, my weight gain, you know, that ladder just not, it ain't cutting. So, you know, I had to have a ladder and this ladder, that ladder out there does up to 375 pounds, Mike. So that's another reason I, I wanted to, uh, now I don't weigh 300, I don't even weigh 300, let alone three, I'm just saying. Uh, it weighs, it does 300 if it's extend all the way out, but if it's in, uh, if it's in a, uh, oh my God, I told you all the ladder meant to go and it slipped my mind again. Step, step ladder, if it's a, a step ladder uh, form, then it holds 375. My shots, no, I haven't taken my shot. My numbers, I don't know. My thing is off. I don't have a. I don't have a thing, and that's how I almost died. And it was the closest I've ever I've been in a long, long. It's closest since my incident, and since the other two times was uh, the the incident, and uh, and when I got thrown out of the back of the truck that I you know did a video on, and I was in uh, high school. I was a sophomore in high school. 
It broke my back in two places, which y'all know. But anyway, uh, yeah, my sugar was so low this morning. I was sweating. Uh, I was shaking already. Uh, I, I got up and I grabbed me a piece of candy because y'all know we keep the candy. I grabbed me a piece of candy and uh, I went, I, I luckily got Kim up. And Kim, uh, Kim come in, I was going in and out of consciousness. Uh, I don't remember, but I was, she said I was going in and she was, uh, you know, uh, uh, you know, smacking me, trying to get me up and keep me awake. And uh, I got some uh, orange juice in me. She gave me some more candy. Uh, and and then uh, uh, she, she fixed me something to eat, too. Uh, I, I don't even know what I ate, but uh, anyway, uh, I'd, I've never went in and out, so I was, I was, uh, I, I, thank you for stopping by. Hello, Troy. Didn't see you in here. So yeah, I was I was uh, I was in and out of consciousness, pretty bad. Uh, my cigar went out. Never really met you real ladder, just your step ladder. Thank you very much, Katie. I don't know if I said hello to you, but hello, Katie. Yeah, it, it was pretty scary. Anyway, you remember I told you all about the truck? Start doing it, going over and getting the ladder. So it started, the, the, the radio and everything started shutting off and everything again. And, and the power, and it's flicking, but luckily got it home. So it's on. So we gotta make an appointment, because they're what they did before. Uh, they're going to have to do again on it. So I don't know if they really fixed it last time because it's already done it again. But I want to get it done now before it's bad, bad. So I want to make sure I'm on top of it. So uh, it was already, by the time we got home, they'd already closed. Uh, so I have to call them in the morning and try to get an appointment. So we're down to one vehicle again. Anyway, where is the mail? Where's the uh, stuff that we sent out? Where's the, just a second. Before you get uh, abducted by aliens. <laughs> Scott, this is my week. Just another week in the life. What can I say? You know, falling, falling, uh, falling on the ladder. Did everybody? Did anybody say bummer on the, the ladder fall? Did anybody say that? I, I didn't get to see those. How much was it? Right here. Gotta put my cigar down. Right here. I'm gonna show you the back of it, like I always. Right here is uh, send out all that tobacco that we did in the packages. So uh, of jails. So uh, Jeff's the one that sent all this tobacco. So right here is the packet. Right here it is. There it is. So every bit of it. Every bit of it. In, unless you went, unless you live out of the United States. If you live in another country, we didn't send yours. So if you won, and I can't remember everybody that won. I just can't remember. I don't know if Tom York won or did he? Kim said she thinks so. I, I, I can't remember. But it, I'm just saying, if you don't live in the U.S., yours wasn't seen, sent. All right, good. Glad, glad you got it. Oscar says, thank you for that. Thank you for what? Katie, thank you very much. 
Thank you for what, Oscar? Did I send you something? Oscar, I can't remember. You have to be a pig farmer first, Mo. Uh, I can't remember, Oscar. Brother, we sent so much, and it was there were so many winners that I don't know. I thought everybody won. Good, Donnie. I'm glad you got yours. Yeah, USPS. Yeah, Boris in Finland got his within two weeks of me sending his. Uh, I, I got mine, but I have, that's all right. I'm glad you got it right. Oscar might be talking to somebody else, and I'm joined. Anyway, the total on the shipping of it all, of what Jeff sent, the total was eighty-eight thirty. And just so you don't think I'm lying, I don't know how to fold this. God, dog, there's a lot to fold on this one. Yes. So here, this is a lot to fold. Here, I'll try. I'm doing my best here to hold it. I'm doing my best to fold it. 8830. Oh, I ain't showing nobody stuff, am I? I told you it's hard. 8830. Hope I didn't show nobody's address. Uh, but anyway, 8830. So just one week, one week of what Jeff sent, which Jeff sent 38 pounds. We sent out about eight pounds. So just that eight pound is 80, 80, 88 bucks for shipping. That's because of all the wonderful stuff that are laid at this. And uh, also, uh, like I said, thank Jeff for, for uh, the tobacco. You please thank Sid for uh, uh, all the, she came to Sid, all the wonderful stuff because she used. She used a bunch of the envelopes to send the stuff, and she used the, the name tags. Uh, uh, the boxes, and she used uh, the, the name tags, and she used the tape, too. So thanks, Ed, for uh, all the packaging stuff, and thank Jeff for, the, uh, for all the, uh, uh, what you call it, Daniel? Uh, I, I've already answered that. I already answered that question, brother. What, you got me on mute, Daniel. Are you behind? You might have to take that little red dot and slide it. I mean, I don't care say it again, Daniel. But I, I, I just I want to figure out if you're behind is, is, is what I'm saying. I was in the bathroom. Got you, got you, got you. So you're not behind. Good, good, good. Daniel, uh... Everybody that's in the United States has been sent out. It was 88.30 to send everybody out. Everybody's out in the United States. Everybody that's not in, if you do not live in the U.S., it has not been sent. That is because you probably, with all the tobacco that we have to give away, and tonight I have to show you all, uh, I was getting ready to show you what Tony sent. So uh, you all know that B-Dog, I'm not going to forget B-Dog. B-Dog sent a box, and there's a bunch of it, and we went through all that, and I showed you all that that B-Dog sent, and I, every bit of it's old. But when I say old, I'm, old sounds bad, aged. It's, it's aged nicely, let's say it like that. Uh, B-Dog sent a lot, of, a lot of nice tobacco that's got a lot of age, and then Jeff sent uh, 38 pounds, uh, and all that's aged. And now Tony sent me some, uh, and uh, all that's aged. And Tony's is all in uh, uh, you suck the air. What's it called? Sealed. sealed uh, vacuum sealed. I, I, I have a problem trying to think of my words, I guess, today. Uh, every bit of it's in vacuum sealed bags, so it's good to go. Uh, Tony even sent money to help with the shipping, and my God, I appreciate that too, Tony. Uh, so it, not just the tobacco, but also, you know, to help with the shipping. And so, you know, thank you so much. Uh, and I'll show you all. I, I don't know if we even, I, well, we probably have time to show it all. 
But I, I mean, showing all of Jeff's took two hours on the not not this live. So I, I just I want to be able to give away more tobacco. I don't want you know to to show, but I want to also show Tony the respect of showing the tobacco. No, 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 no. Get off the couch, Zeus. Get off the couch. What's wrong with you, young man? I've got a headache, and I've had a headache all day. And that's because, can I have, uh, can I have some, uh, ibuprofen? Tylenol, something. I've had a headache all day, and that's because of my sugar. Uh, oh God, I just got dizzy. That's too many, ain't it? That's how many I did. That's like eight. That's six. I don't, six, you're supposed to take four. You're supposed to take two. <laughs> so you're supposed to take two? Then you should, why are you taking six then? Because that's what gets rid of my headache. Well, I don't want to be taking six. But I never, I don't have headaches have some coffee. I have drunk. You know what I saw yesterday? Katie, I took Hunter to the store down here to get him some apples and, and uh, 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 yogurt and stuff. I like Cremora. Do you, I know some people like theirs with Cremora and some people like it with, uh, you know. Sh Zeus, leave her alone. Did he, did she steal his bone? Oh my God. No, that's hers. She's got a bagging strip. He has a big bone. Zeus, eat your bone and quit trying to take her bagging strip. Can can you turn it around to where it's not on anything like this right here? There's like yeah. Nothing on that side. Is there anything Tony, on that side? Where I wrote Tony. Well, Tony's name, I don't care. I'm talking about addresses. No, this is the only side. Okay, well, anything. can you help me reach it up here so I can reach it? I don't want. Here is the box Tony sent. And you see, I wrote Tony's name on it. And it's in there with Jess and B-Dog. And look at this. This thing is about as long as that daggone uh, list of, of mail on list. The receipt. Look at this. And this thing, if you all see, it's a stroke. I don't, this thing I think was 14 pounds. And there is no jars, no cans. This thing is all in bags. And right here, this is Watch City Ahabs, and it's an English. And some of these might be the same, and some of them might be different. There's some more of the same. What is this one? I haven't even gotten them all out. Uh, because I have been, we took Amber back Sunday. Amber came home this weekend, spent time with Amber. Uh, uh, had to take Hunter to the doctor. Now it's just a check up. Uh, I know y'all don't care. Like, shut up, James. This is L.J. Peretti, Cam Birdie, and that's an English too. There is. I'm telling you, there's a ton. This is L.J. Peretti, but it's midnight English, so it's a different L.J. Peretti. This is midnight English. I mean, there's. It is. I can't. I'm sitting here. I'm dropping, it, and I don't want to drop it. There. This thing, Zeus. I can't, this thing, I'm, Zeus. I got Zeus, I got, you all know I got Zeus, I got this, but this thing, I'm going to try to show you, this thing is filled to the brim, talking about coffee, this is filled, look here, it's, it's filled to the brim, all the way up, there is a ton of, tobacco in here to give away to you all and it's all uh tony it's all old right it, how old is it tony from one year old to what how, how what's the oldest one two three four five how i mean like what 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 age is on all these tony yeah i i can't sit here and get it all out but i did get out a bunch and I haven't seen any. Uh, let me let me just reach down. Here, I just reached down. 
about a quarter of the way in. There's H, Triple H Latakia yeah. McBiron. McBiron Latakia. And look at that. I don't even know. I don't even know how much that. There's. I'm telling you, this right here is is a, this right here feels like like this right here feels like eight ounces. And I'm not going to separate this. Ever who wins it is win them one. I'm not going to take it out and separate packages. So if you win, if you want, this is eight ounces. Three to five years, Tony said. My God. So B Dogs is all two to five years. No, B Dog sent that one ten of. No, Jeff sent the ten of McClellan. That is like fifteen year old. That one was, I think. Anyway, every bit, every bit is aged. Every bit of the tobacco, the tobacco that I have, that was in the cellar, was aged. Uh, it's all aged. So I'm going to go back. To my box because I was giving away my stuff and then Jeff sent the stuff and those was in those regular bags and we gave away all that last week so I'm gonna go back to the box that I have that was from my seller and we're gonna start giving away how do you win when I uh, how do you win political pipe just when, when when we do a giveaway say I'm in if it's tobacco that you've never tried that you want to try it. if it's tobacco that you love and it's one of your favorites whatever to say I'm in. And, that, and and that's all you have to do, brother. We give away every every week. We do giveaways. It don't cost you nothing. Like I just said, I've got, where's it at again? I've got 88 pounds. I've got eight, or not 88 pounds. I got $88.30. Uh, uh, I got animals issues. They're wild right now. Uh, that's awesome. I'm in. Well, you can't just say you're in now. I ain't giving away nothing right now. We're all just talking. <laughs> well, I'm in, brother. Hopes and pops. Yeah, and then and then uh, Father Brian said, but I ain't giving away nothing right now. We're just talking right now. I'm trying to show you all what I got in this week to give away. Uh, once, once we do it, then, then I'll make sure you in. And how we do the giveaways, uh, if you stick around, I'll show you. We Kim writes people's names down. And uh, yes, if you haven't, if you haven't sent your uh, address, if you win, Bella, what are you running around for? Who's got you up in a frenzy? <laughs> She's going wild over there. She's going wild. She's jumping around like crazy. Watch at her. Watch at her. 15-year-old cat, by the way, and she don't normally do this. Y'all know she's normally just laying down. Look at her. She, I'm telling you, I, I, like Zeus right now, or little T. I don't know what's going on with her. She's on the couch. Just She, she jumped and knocked stuff down over there. Watch at her. Watch at her. She just knocked more stuff down. Would you quit knocking? I've got... Shh. Bella, what are you doing, baby? Watch out. You don't jump up here, please. She's knocking down, by the way. Here's the thing. This is what she's hitting. Here's my thing. It's 72 degrees outside. 69.8 inside the house right now. And then I have, of course, I have my little teeth things. And that's what she's hitting. I have my remote controls over here. And then I have Q-tips. I like to keep my teeth and my ears clean. I don't know, and then I have my back scratcher. Do y'all have any of these back scratchers? You know where I got this at the hospital. I bought this for a dollar at the hospital about 10 years ago, or 15 years ago. I bought this, I think, when Hunter was born. Before Hunter was born, I bought one for me and one for Kim's mom. And Kim's mom passed away of cancer in, in two weeks after Hunter was born, 15 years ago. I bought these for a dollar at the hospital. I don't know who, it might have been her mom was at, in the hospital. I forget, her mom might have been doing, uh, her mom might have been doing cancer treatments or something. I don't know, but I bought them for a dollar. But anyway, Bella's over here jumping and sliding and carrying on. I'm trying to just sit down. 
Oh, by the way, I do not, Oscar, I don't know if you're still here. Hello, Davies. Oscar, I don't know if you're still here. I used your, uh, your TENS unit. I, I, I want to make sure that I still thank you all, you know, for everything that you all have done for me and my family. I don't want to leave none of you out. I really don't. If you have done something, I, I'm telling you right now, thank you. Uh, Randy said, I have one upstairs. She's watching TV. Mm -hmm. Well, how come she's not down here watching, watching, how come she's not watching Stumbo's Family Gathering, Randy? Am, did, did, am, I, am I not, uh, what would you say, entertaining enough? That something else is the best back shutter I had was a blonde. But I had a redhead that was good also. Hey guys, trying to watch. Oh, enjoy it. Where you at, Captain Bailey? Where you at on vacation at? Probably drinking a beer too, aren't you? Randy said he's having a corona. No. Let's go eat the Are you not entertained? Yeah. That's a that's a, that was a good movie, wasn't it? She is, I thought she, I, I figured, but I, I said, well, she might be ta having an early day. The TV comment was a joke. I, she usually is working. Kim said she might want time by herself. Now, I didn't say that, Randy. I think that, Randy, there's, she, you know, there, you do nothing wrong for her to want time by herself. I did not say that, Randy. I think you're awesome. And, you know, if I was married to you, I wouldn't want time by myself, Randy. I wouldn't be around you all the time, Randy. I didn't say that, Randy. I didn't. See, see, you don't get that from me. I'm good to you, Randy. You can keep it safe. I'm getting ready for a beer myself. Sad's getting 15 inches of snow. Okay. By the way, let me say this. Let me say this right here. Uh, we are having tornado watches. Not warning. <laughs> Zeus, can you leave Bella alone? Or not Bella, up. Uh, can you leave Destiny alone? Zeus, Zeus, please come over here. Zeus. 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 Why do I have to get up? Why can't you just listen to the words? Because you want that bone, buddy. It's her bone. you got to let her have something too, son. Yeah, so if this gets cut off, then it's because of 20 minutes to bow call. I ain't even give away nothing yet. Y'all want to give away something? Let's give this away. It's the same thing. Let's give this away. Let's give this away right off the bat. It's in the can too. I have two of these. I have 10 Russians. Let's give away 10 Russians. This one's in a bag. This is a whole piece of 10 Russians. 10 no, Russians is a Latakia bomb, no. if y'all don't know what it is. And then inside here, there's a little piece in there. And then there's some loose in there. So it's at the bottom of the can. But I am going to send you the can. That way, if you collect cans or whatever, I'm going to send you the whole can. But here is this and 10 Russians is a whole big piece. That's probably, I don't know, uh, 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 like one whole, if it was, what are they, uh, 1.75 ounces. It's probably that. I'm sorry. It, it can't be 20 minutes to bow call. We ain't spend 40 minutes. I haven't even, I didn't even get to show, all, see what I mean? I didn't even get to show all Tony's tobacco. My God, we're flying. So now if you're in, say I'm in. So uh, Katie is in. That's the first one. You was talking to an old girlfriend in Ohio. She's away. Yeah, it's through here. West Virginia has already had a tornado touchdown and it's here in uh, Virginia because Amber was on a tornado uh, watch. He'll be Donnie's in. Uh, Hops and Pops is in. Hops and Pops, if you don't care, send, well, if you win, send your uh, thing to Kim. Political Piper's in. Oh, Kim's got it. Kim shoot me. That means she's got it taken care of. I'm not, I'm shutting the hell up. 
Yeah. You just keep talking about something else. Don't go in there and be by yourself like Randy's wife. Please stay with me. I'm smoking a cigar. I'm lighting my cigar up. Randy's wife's working. I'm just aggravating Randy. He was joking with me. I can joke with him. I didn't get a smoke at all earlier. I had to go outside. And then I was trying to talk and show tobacco. That's what I'm about to peep. I needed a cigar after last night. And like I said, my, my, I had a pipe today, but a pipe, that pipe didn't fulfill what I needed. And I'm just, my body, I don't know, uh, if y'all have ever about went into a, a diabetic coma or not, but my body feels just drained. And I've had a terrible headache all day. And like I said, I fell off the ladder too. I had to go get another ladder. I mean, and I just the last few days have been kind of rough on the old man. How do we know he win? We're going. We're, we're, I'm going to draw right here in just a minute, hops and pops. Then we're going to give him more away, brother. That's you're going to know here in a minute. I'll show you over here. I'll show you the behind. This is this is behind the scenes. I'll show you. I'll I'll show you the whole process, brother. This is behind the scenes. She writes your name down right there. She's writing your name down, and she'll put it in that little bucket right there. And uh, she writes your name down. She puts it in that bucket. She folds them all up. And then we draw. And we draw. Everybody that's in, we draw a name. And whoever wins it, wins it. And we give it away. I don't care who wins it. Pops and Pops. I know this is the first time you've been here. I don't care who wins I don't care if it's a first timer. I don't care if it's somebody that's been here right from the get-go. Uh, right from the very first live I did uh, three, over three years ago. I, I, it don't matter to me who gets the tobacco. Tobacco does not have a soul to me. So if I like a tobacco and somebody else don't, don't bother me. I know some people get mad. Some people argue. I don't know if you come from uh, GPSS or if you come from another YouTube channel, but I don't, I don't, we don't argue here about tobacco. Like some people on the GPSS and other places, they... Oh my God, he smokes an aromatic. He's the worst person in the world. I don't do that. My philosophy is, is I want you to smoke the tobacco that you love and the pipes that you love or the cigars that you love. You smoke what you love. And if somebody else loves it, happy for them. If somebody else don't love it and they love something else, happy for them. I ain't nothing but happy for everybody. Kim said for me to draw two names. I don't know if y'all heard her or not. She said, shut your mouth. And her words are exactly this, and I quote, it was James, shut your damn mouth and draw two names. That's what she said. Did y'all hear? Daniel, Daniel, you're a little too late, brother. I already got the names right here. I, I, I'll put you in, but I, I can't put you in now. It's a little too late. If you're behind and you're on your phone, Sometimes it happens if you're on your phone. Tap your phone somewhere, and at the bottom, you will see a, a, a red line, and you'll see a little red dot. Touch that red dot with your finger and slide it all the way to the right, because it happens to me. Is this all that's in? Yep. This is all that's in, so you got it good. That's right, Pete. Everybody has different tastes. Smoke what you like, man. I ain't here... I don't care what you like. I'm happy for you that you like it and you found something that you like it. That's what I care about. I, I love you. I don't care what you smoke. I love you. Also, uh, also, I don't talk about uh, hops and pops. I don't talk about religion. I don't talk about uh, uh, politics. I don't care if you vote Republican. I love you. I don't care if you vote Democrat. I love you. I don't care if you're independent. I love you. I don't care we have 
people that's uh, uh, Christian here, we have people that's Catholic here, we have people that's Muslim here, we have people that's, I don't know, all kinds of faiths here. I love them all. I, 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 don't bother me, I love you. I'm going to give you, uh, your name is not in here twice because you're, 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 you're Republican or your name's not in here twice because you're Christian. No, it don't work like that way. I love you. I, it don't matter. I, I love you. And, and I just want to see you, you. I just want to make you smile. And that's all I ask for. Everybody will tell you that's been here for three years. All I ask for, I don't ask for nothing. I don't ask for you to do anything. But now, I appreciate it if you do, you know, make like a video or a post or somewhere. Thank you. I appreciate that, but I'm not asking them. Daniel wants a kiss. There you go, Daniel. Just for you, brother. The only thing that I do like seeing, pops and pops, is I do like seeing a, a smile. I, I like seeing that you, you know, uh, uh, I like seeing you, uh, you know, hold up your ever what you got and just smile. I just want to make people smile, man. I just like seeing people smile. That's all I like. Anyway, the straw. See, you got you asked me questions and uh, I can't draw, so we're gonna draw. I'm gonna put you down a little bit farther so you can see. Hello, uh, Sam and Brandell. How are you feeling, Sam? Did hey is uh Matthew ever come in? How's he doing? Did he? How is Matthew doing? If he came in, I didn't see him. Matthew, how, how are you doing? I, I try to ask everybody how they're doing. Uh, uh, also, Donnie, how's your sugar? How you doing? I, I, I'm trying to... I try, I, now, look, if I forget that something's going... Oh, also, Katie, how are you feeling? I sh they're not there anymore. They're not getting who's, there? who's not there? Your next night, I went to eat, well, she's feeling all right. She went to eat dinner, didn't she? I'm good, though. I'm with the wife. Good. All right, we got one out. Oh, I got to draw two, don't I? Yeah. Sorry. I'm going to stick this one in my mouth, and then I'll do the other one. I'm fine. Can you tell me a little bit more, Matthew? Like, the medicine is continuously working. Like, it's, like it, you, like when you say you're fine, I, will, I just want to make sure, brother, that don't happen. That's a scary thing. Is it, you know, like, is it, like, is it, you know, the, the, the likelihood of what I'm asking is, like, because of this mess, like, the likelihood of it not happening is, is good now? Like, it's higher than it was? Like, you know, and I also want to know that you're feeling okay, too, yes. But I, I, I just, I don't want to see it happen to you, Matthew. I don't want to see it happen to you. I, that's all. I'm just concerned. Anyway, I'm going to put this in my mouth and shut up and draw another one. I'm not going to leave the screen. See, I tried to do it so it don't leave the screen. I'm going to put this in the back of my mouth and open one and show you the winner. Take off my glasses. I can't see who won. <laughs> who won? No. Todd. And who won this one? No. Political Piper. <coughs> Todd and Political Piper. Political Piper wanted to send me an email. Uh, Political Piper. <coughs> and okay. Political Piper. I do not have an email. You're new here, aren't you? Uh, if you could send a uh, uh, an email. To my wife and Randy just put her email up there. That's also uh, 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 okay. her PayPal if you ever need to know that. But anyway, that's her email. Send her an email with your name on here, so Political Piper, and then also with your real name and your address, and we'll ship it right out to you. Also, if you live, do you live in the United States? That's all I need to know right now. 
and that way I can explain something something to you and, and Hops. Do you live in the U.S.? This went out too. Thank you. Thank you too. Uh, okay. So if you live in the yeah. Okay. Good. So what happens is if you if you live in the U.S., then we send it pretty much weekly. Pretty much. Uh, uh, now look, my my wife's not retired. I'm retired. My wife's not. She works every day. She goes and works every day. But when she, I do not send it out. When she gets a chance either Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, or Saturday, she goes to the post office, she sends it out. For people that live, uh, the people that live, yeah, it is out, Jeff. The people that live out of the country, we try to send out once a month to let them. That way, it's $24, it's 25 bucks. I was gonna say some change. It's 25 bucks, uh, it's 25 bucks to send it out of state. Out of country, not out of state, out of country. Out of the United States is what I'm trying to say. It don't matter if I send a feather or if I send three or four. So I, I know there's no hurry. I understand that. I'm just saying if you live out of the U.S., then we try to send it like once a month. That way, if you win three or four tens or five or six, whatever, or just one ten, then you're getting it all at once. You're not getting one ten, and then we're spending $25 on sending another ten the next week. It's trying, it helps us save money. Now, the reason I said, if you ever want to know her PayPal, that is also her PayPal. Uh, there's people that helps out, that sends them money to help out with shipping and stuff like that for shipping this out. I, I and you know, and and those are appreciated if if that ever happens, if they do. But you don't have to. Now, there's also a raffle next week. There's also a raffle next week of a pipe that Kim just reminded me of, and I'll show everybody the pipe again. How'd you know what it was, Jeff? Did you just did you see it somewhere? It's like a six thousand or something, Jeff. I don't know what it is. Five thousand. You you and Donnie be able to tell me. You and Donnie be able to tell me. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm not trying to give away the cigar. Because I know I'm close to bow call. It is a nice lighter. I love my lighter, Daniel. Five, yeah, five minutes. That's why I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get me a smoke in. Because uh, this right here is hitting the spot, man. But I've been smoking it now for about an hour. Mm -mm, about an hour and a half. It could be a 7,000. Donnie, you could be right. I haven't looked. I've got the thing over there, Donnie. And these, this, one's, this is, uh, uh, it's the, 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 the wrapper's dark, dark. I mean, it's nowhere, near, I'll show you if I've still got the light, it over there. So you're just staying on it, okay. So they didn't tell you that the medicine, I know, and the reason I said that, Matthew, is because the first medicine, you had one, like, after you was taking the medicine. So I, I didn't know, like, I, I could have forgot, too, and that probably could be my bad, Matthew. You might have said they changed your medicine, and I just forgot. And that's my bad, and my, um, I'm stupid for not remembering. I, 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 I just wanted to make sure that this medicine was weren't. Oh. Yeah, it is, Donnie. It is one of yours. No. I smoked up the, no. like the 2,000, 3,000, 4,000. I only have like, I told you, Donnie, I only have like, I have two, two good ones. No. You sent me like, I forget, but I have two good, you sent me like a 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, and, and a 7,000. And I have like two of the good ones that you sent and then two of the thousands category. And I think I have one left now no. besides this one. And I think this is the biggest one that I had left. Oh, because you had run out of the meds. See, James, have you ever had a Padron 64? Daniel, uh, only once. And uh, I'll buy them for other people, Daniel, but I don't buy them for myself. 
Daniel, I, I, the, a $30 cigar is something I won't spend on me. I don't feel that uh, I just won't spend the money. I, I, I'd rather spend it on my kids or something like that, you know. But, yeah, I, I've had one, Daniel, and uh, they was both given to me. And they are delicious. Uh, the, uh, the, 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 uh, the, the ones that, uh, that are really good cigar smokers, like Jeff and, uh, and Tony, uh, I sent them one, and, uh, that is my favorite of all time, but it had, at the time, I think five years or six years of age on it, when Donnie sent it to me, and my God, it was so, tough. it made me love Padron. And it and it was it was oh my goodness, I can't I can't describe it, I can't even describe it. But see, Jeff smoked his other day and he said he had some peppery, and this some I didn't taste no I did taste the creamy. It was so it was creamy, and me and Jeff was talking about the other day. I didn't get no peppery, but now that could be because of the age. You know, it was it was uh, it was all together blended really nice and it's like this i'm smoking right now this one right here is a dream and it's not even one of those this is like you know seven thousand or whatever you know you're right the will pay startups i'm going to show you this pipe and then i'm going to take my shot because i haven't taken my shot yet and i'm supposed to at 6 30 and it's eight and then we'll do bow call but anyway for, for those of you new here, here's the pipe again that we're raffling off on the night. Uh, here's the pipe. And I'm just going to show it to you real quick because I've already showed it before. Yeah, the chocolate. I got the chocolate, too. I got the chocolate and the creaminess. It's brand new pipe. Never been smoked. It's brand new pipe. It's beautiful pipe. It's it's And that's what we're going to raffle. Now, if y'all give me a minute, I know it's on 8 o'clock. I know it's on 8 o'clock. Patrick, don't kill me. Patrick, don't kill me. We're going to raffle this off on the night. So what that is, Political Piper, and if you're new here, uh, what that is is uh, you send uh, 5 or $10 to Kim per chance. We've done $5 chances. We've done $10 chances. And ever how many... So if say it's five dollars, if you send twenty dollars to the thing, then you got four chances. Is what I'm trying to say. Everybody who puts in gets a chance. We do the same thing. We will put your name uh, four times in the bowl if you do four chances. Put your name four times in the bowl and we draw it out. And uh, that's what it is. Give me a second. I uh, <laughs> I appreciate that, Patrick. I, I just I got my I got to take my insulin shot. I haven't taken it. And if y'all don't know me, I gotta take my glasses off. I know you said you knew. I gotta take my glasses off to uh, to see. Randy mentioned this a while ago. When I first started, in 40 minutes, I don't know. I think somebody come in my house and turn the. Uh, let me finish my shot. I think somebody come in the house and turn my clocks up 40 minutes. All right, I give myself a shot. Here, bud, put it back in the refrigerator for Daddy. Thank you. All right, now that I got my thing, let me see if anybody see anything. You'll see, brother, you got some oldies. Pete, brother, I love you. You know that. Uh, you are too kind. I think that we have a, gr a good family. I was going to say a good group of family, but I thought to myself, that sounds stupid. I think we have a good family. I really do. I love each and every one of I think all of you are, I don't, I, I have no bad thoughts in my head about nobody. I really don't. Are y'all ready for both call? Here, I'll turn you around. Here we go. All right, honey, you got to stand on the other side. That way I can see. Well, that's all right. Stand on that side. You're fine. Go ahead.
Phone call. There you go. Bone call. I am smart. Can, let me go over and grab my, uh, the, see if there's a little piece of paper over there, bub, on that shelf. Uh, a, 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 a warped, uh, oh God, warped what? Coma? Corona. Gorda from 2020. Northwoods and the LCS Briars. Uh, Murray Bone and a Mearsham for me and my man. Hey, Katie, there you are. I thought, oh, beer. No, I ain't having a beer. No, no, no. It's a little, it's a little piece of plastic, bub. Rustica in a rat trays. H and H Vanilla Flake. Yeah, do you like that Vanilla Flake, Todd? Yeah, that. Yeah. I, I, I don't. I, 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 it, trust me. There's something. On, tr by, by me showing this wrapper, people are going to know what that cigar tastes like. Hold here. Let me read. Buy you evening in my Peterson. Not smoking. Oh, you work in the primary elections in New York. God bless you, Patrick. Uh, cobblestone hiking and a Rossi Prince. Not smoke. Laying in. You rest all you want to, brother. You rest all you want to. By the way, I'll tell you all a little story. Me and Boris was talking today. And Boris was wishing me well, checking on, been smoking some of my mix, 965 lately. Uh, too iffy to go out and smoke, so I'm just having some early time. Hey, Ray, how is that whiskey that you bought the other day that you post on Instagram? That looked good. And some Slim Jims. I love, you know I love Slim Jims. Uh, uh, I've already eaten all them Slim Jims that uh, that B Dog and uh, and said sent me. They're gone. Hamburger heifer on an eight-inch plate with a large pork. That sounds good. Iron cobblestone is good. Okay, you're talking to him. Okay, we'll probably be small. Uh, oil it golden slice. Not sure what pop it. That's that loud couple. Now, I'll show you mine. Let me show you mine. And I don't know if it's got anything written on it or not. But Hunter said they ain't got nothing written on it. But I said you all would understand. Look at this. Now, here's the end of the wrapper. Look at this. See what I told you about age? Look at that. You telling me that cigar is not good by just looking at that? Would you just look at that? Just look at that. Would you look at that? Just look at that. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Just look at that. You can tell. And I don't know the size. I don't know the size of this one because I don't see it. There's not a size on it. But yes, it is a handmade Padron, but it, it, Donnie said a 7,000. So I'm gonna take Donnie at his word because uh, Donnie's the one that sent it to me. But my goodness, the darkness that's on that cigar. He said it has nine years of age on it. I'm telling you right now, this thing is, I, oh my goodness. That's, see, that's why I don't wanna smoke. That's why I want to put everything up and let it get age on stuff. Because I'm just telling you right now, uh, that bad boy has at least, yeah, he said nine years, Pete. Yeah, it does, Scott. Yeah, Pat, yeah, Boris, same thing. That's, yeah. It is, I'm telling you. See why I'm sitting here enjoying it? It is. It tastes delicious. I still am going to get me some scope. And and I don't care a bit to smoke this later, either. I don't know if y'all do that, but like if I, I, I'll, I'll smoke later. Oh, uh, uh, Ron, uh, Kendall Gold and a Savinelli uh, Bruno Rustica Apple with Cumberland Stem and Black Coffee. Oh, I was telling you about coffee. Yeah, remind me. See, I get, y'all got me. I, we're moving so, too fast. Uh, the Heaven Hill bottled and, and the bond is good seven year. Uh, really? How much? How much was it, Ray? I know you said that you finally saw it at a good price. How much is a good price, Ray? Cause it, it looked good, but I don't I I, I don't want to spend a lot if I ain't tried it before. The harshness, pro it is, Oscar. That's what I mean. That's the reason I guess I didn't smell. I didn't taste any peppery, in that other one that I had, the real good one. Uh, now the other one was more creamy than this. Uh, I, 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 I got more creaminess in it, but this one is so smooth. It's just, uh, 
Zeus, can you please leave the animals alone, Zeus? Yes. He's not bothering me. That cat's just sitting there. Yeah, he'll be in my seat, but, you know, he'll be okay. Yeah, he's not going to drink that with me. I'm just saying, Joy, I am too, but my God, the time's flying by. That Padron 7,000 is a six. What's that mean? It's a 6,000? Is that what you're saying? Is that what you're saying? Is a 6,000? Is that what you're saying? I don't know what you're saying by that, Patrick. Are you saying it's a six out of a ten? Oh, it's 60 ring gauge. Six and a half inches by 60 ring. Got you, got you, got you. Thank you. Yeah, it, it is. It's... It, I, I I haven't had any trouble. Y'all know I did the straight. I did the straight cut. You can find it online on 45 main store I shop at. Had it at 85. I found it for 57. I would not care a bit, Ray, to buy it for 57 dollars. Once I get some money up, I had to get the uh, amber. Uh, we just restocked her fridge for another two, three weeks, and then I had to pay four weeks, actually, this time. And then I had to get that ladder because I've got to clean out these gutters. You all would make fun of me if you saw my gutters because I ain't been up there. I just had so much stuff. I'm always straight cut. This is an old soul. Same, Jeff. Some well, yeah, okay, that's the same story. Well, I don't want it. Power went out, said. Are y'all, oh, that's because you've got 15 inches of snow, right, said? That's not for the tornadoes, that's for the snow. God, hey, you do have a, uh, uh, a generator, right, said? Well, I did a V-cut, and I did get more flavor, but it seemed like it was more stout. Is that what, is that, is that, is that, is that a right saying? It seemed like it had, it had more, more power to it. Have you ever seen gutter guards, they go in there, uh, Eve event? Yes, I have, Daniel. It don't matter what you do, Daniel, around here. Daniel, cause I, I live in I live in the daggone I live in the daggone woods. I've always been a bee cutter. Yeah, I didn't have I didn't have a problem with the bee cutter. It just seemed it was more I guess because it's it's it comes through in one specific point. Maybe that's why. Wet and heavy snow. See. No generator. Are you said? Do, 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 are you? Are you? Do you have some place to go? I mean, you're not. You have some heat. Fifteen inches of snow. I take it it's cold. So you do have heat, right? Like that's what she said. What Randy said. I forget what Randy said. Yeah, I gotta get me a chew. You see, I'm, 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 I'm telling you. We got the bottle of sweet and sour. Oh, did you really? We'll buy from the Asian market, but never think of going there. Oh, so you liked it. Amber, Amber, if you're on here. She might be just listening. Amber, if you're on here, baby. Ron liked your sauce. And Ron, read Ron's message right above you. Read Ron's message, baby. He like okay, yes, you read it. Okay. This is look. I, I'm not gonna look. I, I ain't no use trying to. Is this what you want me to give away next? This is Peterson Sunset Breeze. These are two that I have, both of them are from 2020, so they're four years of age. This is a blend that I enjoyed, and I've got two of them. 
Uh, let me, I'll tell you about it. This excellent mixture blend of first choice Virginia, Burley, and Black Cavendish. A promise for a unique smoking experience which is crowded by wonderful amaretto aroma that also gives enjoyment to the smoker's surroundings. Uh, so there you go. That's what it is. So there's two of them. Uh, the 2020. So if there's more than two of you, uh, if there's, uh, we'll give away both of them. That's what I'm trying to say. And, and I'm going to ask. I know I don't have to, but I always, uh, I always ask because I'm, I always try to be nice. Is uh, may I have a chew? Daniel's Daniel Leslie's in. Pops and Pops is in. Races and joy. I don't even know where my chew is. This is good at you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Patrick Chan. Uh, are you not one? I thought you said for me to tell you. Oh, you're talking to the dog. Yeah. Zeus is sitting here chewing. He's putting this right on, right on, chewing. Chewing his bone there, knuckle, whatever it is, right on there. And he's, she's telling him, she's telling him, let If y'all don't know, I have, since you're new here, I have a dog. And uh, I have three dogs. I have a, a, well, they're not mine. There's a golden retriever here that's my daughter's. And there's a, a miniature pincher that's supposed to be mine, but she's not. Uh, and then there's a husky here, and the husky is uh, Kim's. And uh, the husky is, I don't know if you've ever had one, but if you've ever had one, a husky is like a two-year-old toddler. And I'm telling you, they're like toddlers. They're into everything all the time, got a ton of energy, never backs down on energy. They have no clue how much energy, like they, I'm telling you, if you're getting old and you don't feel like chasing them, don't get a husky. But now I'm telling you, they're one of the smartest and best dogs and funniest dogs. You will laugh your butt off at a husky because they do crazy stuff. And mine talks. I, don't, I know you probably haven't seen it because you're new here, but there's videos of him on my channel of him just talking his head off. And he talks like he, he just, he gets in arguments with me. So, there you go. I'm getting me a chew right now. Oh, God. And this right here about knocking me over because I'm having to step. I'm not trying to take a chew in front of y'all. I'm trying to step back so y'all don't see. Hmm. Hmm. Amber, did you open up her thing? Two things to show you. Two things to show y'all. I don't think I did. One I haven't opened them, one I have opened. Hunter! Yeah, like a, a Malamute is the same thing, it's just a Malamute's bigger. They're, they're larger than Huskies. Also, I had, did I tell them about having to take uh, Max to the to the doctor because he was uh, peeing blood? I think so. Did I tell y'all about that? That was last week, but did I tell y'all? I don't know if I did. Anyway, Amber, I got a thing here. This is from Virginia, and it is from the Department of Health Professionals. Are you still with me, Amber? Can you hear me, baby? Well, uh, uh, Max, the golden retriever, uh, was... Uh, okay, uh, yes, open it. Okay. Uh, Max, the golden retriever, he was peeing blood. And so I had to take him to, to the vet. 
uh, last week and uh, uh, got him some antibiotics. So he anyway, and he had a, he had a bladder infection. Uh, Kim said, "Who? Bridget. Bridget. I can't I can't read Kim's. I can't I can't say none. I'm trying to open a piece of mail uh, that was sent to Amber, and it, I think it's what I think it is." Dear Amber Grace Thumbo, congratulations of your recent approval of your application to practice of pharmacy in the Commonwealth of Virginia. So you are now a pharmacy intern, and here is your license. I thought that they didn't send no little. So I don't know if she's getting it separately. Yeah, I don't know if you're getting a little card like they sent it here in Kentucky, Amber. But uh, well, I guess it don't matter if I show their. Well, this is your ad. I'll fold this back. I'll fold it like this. That way, it don't show yours. Here you go. Congratulations, Amber. For those of you who are new, Amber's our daughter. So the, if you all don't know, Amber's if you're new. Amber's uh, our daughter, and uh, she's going to school uh, in Virginia to be a pharmacist. And she had to get a license. She has to get her license in Kentucky because she lives here, and she had to get her license in uh, Virginia. She had, she had to do two different tests, two different things. So, of course, it's Amber. She passed. And I, I, I'm You all scrolling up, and I can't see. You're saying congrats, Amber. Yeah. So. And then uh, asking how Jacob and Paul are with their teeth. Oh, how is Jacob and Paul? Are doing well, Jacob? Okay. Yeah. Bridget, that's the same way it was with the, these kids. That's the same way it was. It seems like we give them antibiotics, Bridget. My goodness. It heal them up for like two weeks or three weeks. And then the fourth week, they was back sick again. And then the fifth week, we would take them back to the doctor then the sixth and seventh and eighth week, they was good. And then the night, that happened for two years, Bridget. And I'm telling you, they, they we, we uh, well, I, I'm over-exaggerating that, but it seemed like every two, every two weeks we had them. In. There was so many ear infections, though. It was ridiculous. No sooner with the I mean, no sooner would we get them ready, it, it, they, they were back again. It just seemed like it was every two weeks, but... I know it was spread out more than that because we, we didn't go, you know, 104 times, uh, you know. Uh, we didn't go twice a week, you know, that's what I'm trying to say. It, it just seems like... Every years. It, it just seems like, you know, I mean, we had to go 30 times to the doctor, and it did for like a couple weeks. Or a couple years, not a couple weeks, sorry. But anyway... Uh, Hunter is in the bathroom. When Hunter comes, I'll show you his thing that he got in the mail this week. Because Hunter, he's not in here, so I'll brag on him because he can't hear me. Because, uh, you know, I don't want it to go to the boy's head. But Hunter, uh, if y'all don't know, Hunter is right now not competing with Amber. And what I mean by competing is Hunter's not on par with Amber. And Amber, you all know how smart she is. Hunter is above in his stuff than what Amber was. He's he's above in uh, he's above in uh, in like uh, uh, the test and all that stuff. He is scoring above her, and so that's how smart he is. Uh, but now I don't know. But now being smart's one thing. Having drive and determination. I don't know if that's you, I don't know if that's where, she's that's where she's, I think she, it, you know, I got to be honest, you know, I think that's where she's got him a little bit because her, I I have, her drive and determination is just, I, I haven't seen it. Can I have a speak up? Yeah, I'll draw too. Hunter, bring me your uh, paper that you got and your medal. And I'll draw two time you're in there. Father, it's all right. You're in here, isn't it? Yes. Father, you're in this. 
Kim got you. No, no need to worry. Kim got you. By the way, speaking of amber, I'm going to draw these. And then I'll tell you another thing about amber. Oh, I, I drew out two. So I had two together. There's two there. I'm going to set this down. And I'll open two. So let me open these two. And then I'll tell you about amber. I can't see who it is, but I can see the thing. I can see it's on that side. I can't see who it is. Oh, that one. Popping couple. Sam Brandel. And political. Didn't political popper just win? Yep. Mm -hmm. My goodness, that's a, the new. He is the new uh, Patrick. He's the new Patrick. Can I have a speak cup? Oh, I got it right here. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, congratulations, Sam or Brandale. So anyway, let me tell you about Amber. Since we're talking about the kids, before I even get on hunting and show you is, I'll stay on Amber. Let me tell you something. I do smell that. What is that? You got the oven on? What is it? Food? What are you fixing? You don't want me to know? No? Well, one of it is uh, um, jalapenos stuffed with uh, cream cheese wrapped in bacon. Jalapenos, peppers, stuffed with cream cheese wrapped in bacon. And the other one is a pizza. So that's one. I, I haven't had supper yet, y'all. And uh, I haven't had supper. So I'm getting, I don't know if y'all like them. I love jalapeno stuffed. I love peppers, stuffed with cheese. I love that. I love jalapeno pepper stuff. And then uh, she's fixing the pizza. Anyway, let me tell you about Amber before I forget. It seems like I, I, I can't. Time's a flying. I want to give away more stuff. Anyway, let me tell you. Let me tell you some more. Amber just she come home this weekend. We went and got her Friday, and. Uh, Took her back Sunday, you know. But anyway, Amber told me time she was here. Uh, she is off for six weeks during the summer, right? They get a summer. She's already found her a job. As you all know, Amber worked before she went over there. She already, she's going to be working in Virginia for three weeks. And then she's going to come home for three weeks. When she comes home, the place that she's working at, the place that she's working at in Virginia is how far from her place there? About 30 minutes. About 35 minutes. So she's going to be working. She's going to have to drive 35 minutes to her job uh, while she's off. So she's off for six weeks, three weeks of it. She's working in Virginia, and the job is 35 minutes away. She's going to come home for three weeks, and during those three weeks, she's already set herself up a job, and she has to drive an hour. And Ray, I know if you, Ray, if you're still here, you probably know uh, uh, where Hazard is. He's just on the air. So she's going to be driving from from here to to all the way to Hazard. And uh, Hazard's about an hour away from us. And she's going to be driving out, you know, an hour or two job and an hour back home every day. So, you know, you all helping us out, you know, you all help out, you know, uh, of helping me when I sell stuff, you know. But when I'm, well, the point I'm trying to make is, is that, she, it's not just that she's trying to help herself, too. It's what I'm trying to say. She's not just sitting here and doing this, you know. Tell Daisy. Uh, Daisy's probably old by now, Troy.
I think I think that, that whole group probably. Uh, I'm old Joyce. We all are Joyce. But anyway, Hunter, where's yours at? Let me show them yours before I do another giveaway. Yeah, bring it over here. Give me the paper. So Hunter won. No, don't bring it over here. Bring that black thing. Bring it over here. Let me do it. Just bring it over here. I'll do it. My God, is it? Bring, give it here, son. So Hunter won the award. Oh, you can't see, but that big shiny metal right there. And then here. And then here's the paperwork with it. And he got, I'm trying to scooch it back a little bit. There's tassels and stuff, and there's tassels. That were cords, oh. sorry, cords. Oh. But anyway, uh, this is for, uh, oh. the National Society of High School Scholars, NSHSS, today announced that uh, student Hunter Stumbo from McDowell, Kentucky has been selected to become a member of the esteemed organization. The society recognizes top scholars who have de dem I got spit. Sorry. Probably didn't even get our camera view. What was that? The society recognizes top scholars who have demonstrated outstanding leadership, scholarship, and community commitment. The announcement was made by the NH NSHSS co-founder and president James W. Lewis. On behalf of blah, 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 a member of established Nobel Prizes, a moderate recognize the hard work, passion, and commitment that Hunter has demonstrated to achieve this exceptional level of academic excellence. Uh, Hunter is now a member of the unique scholar community who represents the very best hope for the future. And I, there's not anything on here. There's not any, well, their, their phone number's on here, but there's not any address. It's right here, I'll show it to you. Now you see the top of it. Anyway, and then at the bottom of it, as you all seen, there's a diploma. That's what fell. That's what y'all kind of seen. I'm trying to show it to you. So uh, there's a diploma in it as well. So let me try to put the... I was trying to take it all out, and I was like, no, just let me do it this way. So anyway, and it's this is a fancy folder. That's what I wanted to show you, too. Look at this thing. It comes in this big fancy folder and it's got a little slit right there. That just slides down in there, buddy. I can't see what y'all seeing, but I think I put on my glasses to see. <laughs> he, he took his stuff back in there. He didn't get too excited. Hunter! They're all saying congratulations, and you went in there. He's in there putting it away. See, if it had been me, I'd have said thank you before I left. But we'll, we'll, we'll let him say thank you when he comes back. They're all congratulating you. Thank you. Oh, i got to turn you around. Go ahead. Thank you all. I appreciate it. There you go. That's about as much excitement you're going to get out of a 15-year-old boy. Unless. I ain't going to go with that conversation. But we'll just, we'll just say that's about as much excitement you're going to get. Katie said mental hugs to you, Hunter. Bridget, we do have some wonderful kids. We do. I feel very blessed. That is awesome. Hammers and pop, that's what we I was talking about earlier. I had Hunter down there. Uh, he, he gets ready to take his... Well, it, it, he was born on 6'5", so it's only like two months away for his learner's permit. And uh, uh, at 15, I was expelled from middle school. I never got expelled. I got spanked a few times, but never expelled. Uh, but anyway, I was showing him 
uh, I was showing him things I wanted him to know. And I, I don't know if he's here, and I'll just mention like one of them, like slowing down before you get the curve. Like, you know, a lot of people, uh, when they start out, they, they, they wait till they get to the curve before they slow down. You know what I'm saying? I don't want him to do that. I want him to, uh, I want him to slow down before he gets to the curve. And then once he's coming out of the curve, he can speed back up again. But make sure he don't, you know, take the curve too fast. And trust me, the reason I say that and why that's important here is because I live in the country and that's all we have. We have curves here that the back end of your car will touch the front end of your car going around them. That's how, that's how sharp the turns are, the curves are here. They are curves everywhere. And I, you know, if this is where he lives and this is where he's going to be driving a lot until he gets out and gets a job or whatever, then he needs to know things like that. And so I took him down to the bottom and we have an acre of land down there that he can drive the ranger around. And I was trying to show him things. So, well, I, I, I wouldn't have it any other way, Randy. I love, uh, you know, people can say what they want about country folk, but, you know, uh, they're some of the best-hearted people in the world. And uh, like I said, if you break down, your car breaks down. People ain't going to have no money to help you. So you're not going to have, there's no money here at all. So that's one thing you don't want to come to the country for is money because you're not going to find it. Uh, but they have heart. And people here, if you're broke down, they will stop and try to help you. Either help push you off the road or help you change a tire or whatever. You know, uh, it's good that way. Uh, but uh, I love the peace and quiet of it. I like going outside and watching. I, I see a squirrel every day of my life. I see deer, not every day, but I see a squirrel and stuff. Um, can't fix or build nothing? Well, I understand that. I never, I, I wasn't a carpenter myself, but uh, here, here the last, uh, I built my own house, I built this house, but I never did go to carpentry school, uh, uh, you know, uh, but, you know, I just had drive and determination. And, uh, you know, I built all the cabinets here, and you can go back in my YouTube, and my son, he wanted a daggone, uh, he wanted a daggone nightstand, I built him a nightstand. You know, he wanted a bed, I built my couch, I built, uh, uh, I, I built everything in this place. I built everything in this house. Everything from the doors to the windows to the beds, the couches, the the the, uh, uh, the cabinets, the uh, uh, closet doors. Uh, I, I, everything, everything you see. The best I can do is a sandwich. Well, if you ain't got, look here. If you. If you're in the country, that's another thing you're not going to have. There is no, I always like to say there is no Maytag man. Uh, you're not going to call Maytag. If your freezer tires up, your fridge tires up, you better learn to fix it. Or get on YouTube and try to figure out what it is. And do, uh, you know, Amber and Kim has fixed the dryer before by themselves when I, when I couldn't, when I wasn't there. Uh, I, I fixed the dryer. I fixed the washer. I fixed my central heating and air. Uh, uh, no, there's nothing wrong with building a good sandwich. That's a fact. You just, you, you learn to do, because you've got, look, if you're going to live and you're going to have it, you got to fix it. It's already tore up, so you, you're not going to tear it up any worse than what you've done, you know. So, anyway. Ah. Mike, we got 24 minutes. Mm -hmm. uh, it seemed like it, uh, all joking aside of the minor stuff, I figured he was joking a little bit. What is this? This is Rat Trey's Wallace Flake. Rat Trey's Wallace Flake. This is uh, from, uh, from uh, 320, and it's got uh, 721. So this is three or four years old. What is Wallace Flake? Wallace Flake is an excellent blend. It's Virginia tobaccos of Virginia's ranging from gold to chocolate. 
is combined with sun-cured Indian, Indian tobaccos and uh, uh, rounded off with a very light plum aroma. So it's sun-cured Indian tobaccos, but mostly it's, it's uh, just different Virginias. So it's Virginias with some Indian tobacco. So it's uh, Rat Trades Wallace Flake. So if you're in, say I'm in. Oh, are they? I, they're already ahead of me. There you go. Be, get ahead of me. York is in, uh, 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 Yornick is in, Katie's in. That should be a clone to Peterson University flight. Another one that I've not tried. If you're new here, that's why I started out years ago. And I started giving the, in the GPSS uh, six years, seven years ago. I started giving uh, uh, tobacco away, samples away to people. And we we do 75, 175, 200. Uh, I made sure that one time that I, I made, I, I was 201 is the most samples I've ever sent somebody. It was 201 samples. And uh, I, want, I counted them twice. And the reason I did 201 is I want to make sure that I had over 200. But uh, I would send, you know, like I said, uh, 50, 75, 100. And, and it's people that was kind of new, but also people that, um, you know, maybe maybe they uh, had not been new, and, but they hadn't tried a lot. Kind of like Father Brian that year. He said he's tried 60 blends. I've tried 900 blends, you know. I've tried so many blends that I forget what half of them, not half, I forget what three quarters of them is like unless I read the, the, the dirt sheet that Amber and Kim has down for me on what's called. I forget it. Uh, matter of fact, you'll hear me sitting here asking. I, I'm not going to sit here and act like I know everything there is. If I don't know something, like I say, I don't know what's in this blend, then I'll ask and people, and people's been smoking longer than I have that's on here. Uh, the family here has got a quite wide range. They'll tell me. But that's what started off is, I know how hard it is to go out and work. And, and you know, you go out and you work and, uh, you know, and you get, you know, whatever, $10 an hour, $20 an hour, whatever you make. And one can of tobacco to try was $10 at the time. Now, I've been smoking when it was $6.99. I can remember buying McClellan for $6.99. Then it moved up to like 10. Now I looked, and and a lot of the ones on what you call it are up to like close to 15 now. And uh, that's an, I look at it, way I, what I'm trying to say is I look at it like it's an hour's work. And my God, you know, some of the people work their butts off, man. And, you know, to have to go work your butt off for an hour to try a blend that, and I, I'm not complaining. Don't don't take it as a complaint either. Let me say that right off the bat too, because we have, in my opinion, and other people can have their own opinion. I'm not here to argue. Y'all know me, but in my opinion, we have it good here in the states because if you look at other countries, uh, you know they're talking about forty, fifty dollars a ten, and ours is ten, fifteen dollars a ten. So uh, this stuff ain't from jail. Now, the stuff you win tonight is from me. It comes from my cellar. The stuff, uh, I give credit where credit's due, but the stuff you win in tonight is from me. It's from my cellar. Now, uh, I, I, the reason I took out of my cellar is because everybody, last year, we spent, oh my God, probably, oh my God, 10 months uh, out of 12, maybe 11 out of the 12 months last year, given a way of what everybody else sent. And and I've still got the rest of the year. I don't even know if I can give away all this rest of the year. 
Uh, I, I'm, I give away as much as I can each week. Uh, but I've still got B-Dogs, and i got Jeffs, and i got Tonys to give away the rest. And, you know, uh, and, and I thought that I should contribute some tobacco, you know. And I felt bad, you know. I, I felt bad. I wanted to contribute some. And I looked, and it's stuff that I, I've told everybody here knows. If it's, a, I break down my tobacco to say a three star, three and a half star, four star, four and a half. I even break it down like 4.8 uh, blends. I'm not smoking a three star, three and a half star blend. I'm about four stars about as low as I'll go. I'm smoking the blends that I enjoy, truly enjoy. I got 20 years if statistics are correct. Now, uh, statistics for where I live in Eastern Kentucky is 71 years age. Now, if I live in New York, like let's say Patrick, Patrick lives in New York, the, the age for a male there is 83. But where I, where I live is 71. Now, that has to do with, you know, whatever factors. I'm not here to talk about that. I'm not a health professional. I can just tell you what the statistics show. I got 20 years of, of life, less than 20. And I'm just going to say, well, I say 20 because I'm going to be 49 the rest of my life. But... Uh, you know, I'm not, I, I'm, I'm smoking the blends that I love and the pops that I love or the cigars that I love. And that's what I'm going to do. And, 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 and I want, I want to, I want to smile. I want to be happy. I don't want to cause no sadness on anybody else. I want everybody else to smile and be happy. And if I can put a smile on somebody's face, I want to try to do that. It ain't got nothing to do with, well, I feel sorry for this guy. This guy might be poor. I don't know if you're poor. I don't know if you're rich. I, don't, I have never once asked anybody here, and, and all, are, you know, are you poor? Are you, I've never once asked that, and I never will because it's the same thing as all the other stuff. I don't care what you are. I love you. I love you. I don't care what you I love you. All you have to do is come here, show up, say I'm in, and and uh, you don't have to, but, you know, if you send me a picture of you smiling, it'd make me smile. I promise you that. But now, like I said, if you do a video of, of VR, or if you do a video, or if you do, uh, you know, a post, man, I appreciate you took the time out of the day to say something nice about you know, me or my family, and I, you know, I really appreciate that. I don't want you thinking that I don't. Yeah, that, uh, that, yeah, that makes me happy. I mean, to see posts and stuff that, you know, that, that makes you happy. It makes you feel good, you know. But I'm trying to do good things, and that's it. That's all we're trying to do, make people smile. And that's exactly the reason uh, Tony, uh, B Dog and Jeff, that's the three people that sent. Now, more sent last year. I'm just talking about this year. Uh, you know, they, they want to see that too. They want, they, you know, and everybody else in here does too. Everybody else. I'm not just doing those three. I'm just said those three sent this year, but everybody in here is a good group if you're new. Everybody in here, I love my family, and, and we're, everybody's great. They really, oh, you can't see. Let me scroll down. Let me scoot you back. I'm trying to show you all. How many am I picking? One? Yeah. Picking one. One out of all this. Hello, Devious. Kim, hug James right now. He deserves it. Katie said, hug James right now. He deserves it. Can you not aggravate him? Please, he just sit down. Don't go, watch him. He's wanting Hunter to pet him. Watch. watch it. We'll draw in just a second. Watch. watch. Stop petting him. Watch him grab Hunter's hand. Now pet him again. Yeah. Now stop petting. Yeah. Well, Max is going underneath. He's looking at Max. Pet him again, see if he does it. Now stop. Yeah. Yeah, now pet him. Yeah. Pet him, that's what he wants, pet him. Watch at him. See what I mean? See what I mean about toddler? Toddler, buddy. Just toddler. I just fired up a bowl of H.H. Stark Fire in my Rossi office. That's good. I hope you enjoy it.
I'm telling you, Scott, buddy, spoiled rotten. That's when you know you spoiled them. That's when you know you got them spoiled. I don't even. I said B Dog's name like ten times tonight, and I don't no. know. I don't know if he. Uh, I don't know if he heard me or, or not. But hello, B Dog. Hey, Chase, is that your bone, buddy? You threw your bone in the floor. Hey, don't start running around now. Don't start jumping. I don't know if y'all seen him. He just jumped from the couch all the way over here, and he's got his tail curled. Oh my God! I shouldn't eat. See what I mean about don't get him started. If he's laying down, let him lay down, please. Please let him lay down. Lay down, would you please? Would you lay down? Please lay down. Lay down. My goodness. I've stirred this up enough. I don't know why I stirred, I can't see. I just do it out of, there I got one. Hold that, let me pull this in. I don't know why I stirred. I can't see who won my glasses on. Especially if it's light. I can see that blue though, it's on this side. I don't know who it is. But here. Todd. Now, uh, I, I don't know, so I'm gonna ask this question. Do you and Todd have y'all's addresses fixed? Yes. You do? Todd, she said 4113. Is that correct, Todd? Is that correct, Todd? Todd, is that correct? Todd's probably not even here. He might be. I'm just aggravating you, Todd. Are you here? I don't see him typing. Pop again for next week. Well, I'm waiting on Todd show to pop again for next week. Yes. Is it next week? Oh, yes. T Todd said yes. That is 4113. That's correct. Here's a pop for next week. What do you all think we should put on it? $5 or $10? What do you all think to buy a thing? What do you all think? $5 or $10? This is all goes to Amber. This pipe was sent. This pipe was sent by pot i say pater but it's potter piper which is father brian who was here earlier i don't know if he's still here or not i haven't heard him talk in a little bit but this was sent by there he is he said ten dollars we can do that it was sent by him and he sent it for amber he sent it for amber to put the proceeds and that's exactly where all the money will go so this pop is for amber it is a raffle $10, they say $10, we'll do $10. Uh, also, who was the one that you said that you haven't received money from? Cool. Troy. He needs our mailing address, I'm sure. Troy, need, do you need our mailing address, Troy? Because Kim told me and I forgot all about it. Because Troy was in, I don't, how much was it? I don't even know. He was in for $5? He was in for $5. No, I have you. I did. Okay. Okay. So here it is. Here's the pipe. It is not nine millimeter. It is. Uh, is it? He said I forgot. I think it's twenty. Shit, oh, Troy. Oh look, Troy. It's I have no. Chance, so I have no clue, Troy. It could be Troy. I don't know nothing. She's telling me, and you tell me. So she four, said it was five dollars a chance. If you did four, Troy, there you go. But I don't, I don't keep up fat. You know me, Troy. That's not my. Uh, that that's that's above my uh, pay grade, Troy. That's above my. Uh, that's above my pay grade, brother. But yes, uh, yeah, Chad, who who. Uh, oh my goodness, what is his? Uh, Le yeah, but what? It's not lethal precision anymore. It's Griffith. Griffith pipes, uh, lethal precision. I think so. It is now. And you get the cool sock like me. And Kim said to not forget. Don't give Troy all the credit. Not Troy, Troy, not Troy. Dag on it. Chad. 
Got so many names. See how it is? Uh, uh, got so many names. I can't. Anyway, don't forget about Chad's wife who made the pipe sock. So don't give all credit to uh, Chad. Got to give his wife some uh, credit too. She made the pipe sock. And so it's handmade pop sock that she made. So give her some credit too. Thank you, Chad's wife, for 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 uh, doing that. So I got it back up. Give it to Kim, and that's next week. And I have seven minutes. Y'all want to do another, uh, y'all want to do one more giveaway? You want to talk for a few minutes? We only got seven minutes to go. What y'all want to do? I'll, I'll leave it up to you all. Y'all want to talk about what we're going to have to eat? Y'all want to talk about anything in particular? Uh, or, or, or do you want to uh, do a giveaway? I'm in. So you want to do a giveaway, okay. We'll do a giveaway. This last one, then, is a giveaway for two more tins. And this is, if y'all don't know, Early Morning Pipe by Peterson. This is from 2020. And I write the numbers on the back. As you can see, 2020. So this is four-year-old. Three, three-and-a-half-year-old, four-year-old. Uh, early Morning Pipe. So, uh, Father Brian's in, Hops and Pops is in. Well, I ain't gonna read that message yet, don't it? Yeah. All right, I'll shut up. I'll just shut up and chew my back. Oh, time I'm done that, here, I'll thank you all. Since we ain't got much time. Thank you, Amber. Uh, thank you, B-Dog, uh, or John. Thank you, Boris, thank you, Bridget, thank you, Captain Bailey. Uh, thank you, Daniel. Thank you, Devious Piper. Thank you, Hops and Pops. Thank you, Donnie, Hillbilly Piper. Thank you, Hammer and Pipe. Thank you, JB Afternoon. Thank you, Kevin or Jersey Piper. Thank you, Todd. Thank you, Troy. Thank you, Noah Arnold. Who didn't he, Mark? Thank you, Paul. Who else? Which Paul? Papa Bear? Papa Bear. Okay, I'll thank him when I get down to it. Uh, thank you, Oscar. Thank you, uh, Mike, who was only here for a second, but thank you for stopping by. Uh, thank you. Oh, by the way, if you uh, thank you for all the likes. I don't know how many there. I can't see. But thank you for the likes. Thank you for the comments. If you've liked it, uh, thank you, Papa Bear's Nook. Thank you, Father Brian. Potter Popper. I've messed it up for about the first month. I said Pater Popper, but Potter Popper. Thank you, Patrick. Uh, and, and good luck on your uh, working tonight at the election. Thank you, PDF. Thank you, Matthew, Pick and Popper. I'm glad the message's working. Thank you, Sid. Brother, I uh, said, I know uh, you pirates going out and in. You might not be here. You might be here. Thank you for everything. But, brother, I hope everything, I hope it don't go out again. Uh, I, my God, without pirate during 15 inches of snow. Uh, thank you, Sam and Brandell. Well, I didn't even get to talk about it. I was going to talk about what me and Boris talked about earlier. Was, I'll talk about that in a second. Thank you, Sam Brandell. Thank you, Ron Hardcrackers. Thank you, Tony. Signalman Tony. Thank you, Randy. And, and Jeannie, she's watching TV. Thank you, Bob. Thank you, Scott, which is Tramper Scott. Thank you, Jeff, West Virginia Cigars, who would like to have a cigar right now in King. And thank you, uh, I don't think it was Jornick. I think it was Katie this week. Thank you, Katie. But if Jornick was, she would thank you, too. Me, Boris asked me, he's like, hey, he was looking, he saw Ryan Hall, y'all. And Ryan Hall, if y'all don't know, is, is, he has millions of followers. But uh, uh, he lives over at Pikeville. Uh, I've been to his house and everything, like I know Ryan. And uh, anyway, uh, Boris is like, I hope, he's like, I'm watching Ryan. And, and I, I watch Ryan sometimes. And I get on there, and I was on there, you can ask Boris, I was on there for maybe five minutes. Four, three, four, five minutes. But five minutes tops. He had 76,000 viewers. 
and he had two thousand dollars get you know through the um, uh, Super what's it chat. called? Super Chats. And this is what I was laughing about with Boris. He had two thousand dollars in the Super Chats, and people were asking, him, "When's the storm coming here? When's the storm coming to Ohio?" And and they would say their city. You see what I'm saying? They would say, uh, you know, when's the storm coming to uh, Dayton, Ohio? I'm just picking a place. I don't know. And they would send like $500 and be like, when's the storm coming to Dayton, Ohio? And somebody else sent him 100 Somebody sent him 200 And they was asking. And I sent $2, and I said, hey. I said, hey, Ryan. I said, when's it going to hit us here in Floyd and Bike County? And uh, he, he answered me for $2. I didn't send no twenty or or hundred or two hundred or five hundred. I don't have nothing like that. But anyway, uh he he give everybody the same answer. And the answer was is I don't know when it's gonna hit. If it is gonna hit, nobody knows. <laughs> I was laughing with Boris and I was like, Dad go it everybody spent somebody spent five hundred dollars to get the same information I did for two. Because he don't talk to you unless you do, you know, do a, you know, a, 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 a super chat. And, uh, and I was like, you know, most, most, uh, most weather people say, you know, well, they look at the radar and they go, well, you know, the storm is going to be bypassing, you know, this place at, uh, you know, four o'clock or whatever, you know. And uh, I told Boris, I said, that's funny. And, but, and Boris was telling me, he said, well, he makes videos, you know, uh, he makes videos, and they have to watch those videos to see what the forecast is going, like, you know, when the storm's going to hit their area. And I told Boris, I was like, that is smart, because, you know, he's making ads, and on his videos, he gets hundreds of thousands of views, if not a million, or me, probably gets a million views, but you know, the ad revenue that he's bringing. And it's smart by not saying when it's gonna hit on the live because he's making them watch the, the video. And I thought to myself, my God, that's smart. You know, but you know, you, you would think though for, you know, if somebody spent a hundred, especially $500, that you would tell them, hey, my best guess is you all, you know, you. If you're going to get hit, it's how I would say it. If you're going to get hit, it'd probably like, you know, pick a time, 4 o'clock. Let's stick with that. You know, but he didn't. He didn't know nothing. He said, I don't know when the storm, nobody knows if a storm's going to hit. <laughs> I was like, gold. It's like It's like somebody giving me $500 and ask them what I like. Uh, about you know a certain blend, whatever. Uh, let's just this one right here, that uh, uh, early morning pipe, and me saying I don't know if you're gonna like it or not. Not telling you anything about it. I don't know. You know, it wasn't that far from me. No, the, no, a tornado hit. Uh, yes, a tornado uh, is more accurate than uh, national weather. Yeah, I agree with that. I agree with that. He is good. Uh, uh, yeah, a tornado hit in West Virginia. Uh, and then, like I told you, I was telling Boris, Amber was on a tornado watch, not a warning. A warning's when it happens, right? A watch is, it could happen. Amber's school was on a tornado watch. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, one did hit down in, in West Virginia. And Proctor, uh, Ohio. And Proctor, yes. Yes, we actually, uh, Kim flipped it over there. Kim flipped, flipped it over there to watch him. One hit Proctorville, Ohio, and tore up the school. But school is out this week on spring break there. So no, 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 uh, no, uh, no, nobody was harmed. And Newcastle in Northern Kentucky got hit pretty badly. So there you go. See, I haven't heard, I didn't hear that one. I just thought it was funny. Ain't nobody laughing. Everybody's like, I don't care, James. 
Ain't nobody laughing at me telling the story. But yeah, I'm in a tsunami hazard zone here. No tornado shit. Well, that's good, but tsunami's pretty bad itself. I seen a, a tsunami one time. I think it was in Japan. It was on. Uh, it was on YouTube. It come on, popped up. I don't. I don't. I, I go to some people's channels, but then mostly it plays recommended. And most time it plays pipes. But uh, one time I don't know how I got over there. It went over to, uh, and this was years ago. Uh, I've been watching YouTube now for I don't know quite a while, but because I don't watch regular TV much, as y'all know, and I, I definitely don't watch stuff like the news, and, and I don't watch the weather. Or I don't watch political channels and I don't watch none of that. Uh, but anyway, it's several, but anyway, it popped over in Japan and they, it, it was bad. Hello, Tom. We're getting ready to get off, Tom. Radioactive popped up there. Yeah, well, this one, it, it destroyed everything. Might have been saying the same thing. All right, Bridget. We're about ready to get off our shelf, Bridget. It's 9.03. Oak We're going to watch Oak Island. What do we have, two? Yes. Well. Got two. We in close. We're not going to Get out, Bridget. That tastes off. I can see it's on that side. So Katie won. Yornick and... Sid. So Sid and Katie. Katie, you know, girl, that I'd be happy to send it to you and Yornick in Russia. You know that it would make, be an honor and a privilege and a pleasure. It would make my face smile and uh, to send it to you. But I figured that was coming. I see, before I even got the words out of my mouth, I knew you was going to give it away. That's what I was getting to. But you won't let me send it because your all's postage sucks, there you said. So send it to uh, Devious. Sharing is caring. That's right, Katie. And Katie, you know I love you and you're in it. Uh, and, and, you know, uh, y'all make me smile. And I'm sure, uh, I'm sure Devious is, is uh, thankful and you making him smile. But yes, thank you all. Uh, thank y'all for another I, I tell y'all every week I'm not lying uh, Tuesdays is the happiest night of my week I love my I love I love my Tuesdays you know thank you all for always being here and, and always supporting me and my family and for always showing me and my family love thank you for just being good to us you know, I tell you, and I, 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 you know, I'm not saying that. Y'all, the people that B Dog's been here, Josh has been here, and the first thing I did was give him a hug. That's me. I'm, I'm not, I'm not any different uh, off camera, as they say, than I am on camera. Uh, this is me, man. This is me. Uh, you know, and to have somebody to love me. That's all anybody wants in this world, ain't it? You know, at the end of the day, it ain't gonna be about money or nothing. It's gonna be about the memories. And to have somebody love you, to me, is the greatest feeling in, in the world, to know that you're loved. 
and you all make me feel like that each and every week. And, you know, I, I appreciate it. That's all I can do. Uh, it, look here, if you want to, if you want to, you know, if you if you want to put out a, a, a video or something, you know, uh, whatever it's called about the pop uh, uh, thing next week, the pop uh, uh, raffle. raffle, about the pop raffle, uh, you can go and get a picture. Uh, uh, do you want to do a thing? I tell you what I'll do for you. Get me the uh, get me the pop, and that way, if they want to get a picture, they can take a screenshot. Go get me the pop real quick, and I'll flip it around to the good camera, and I'll set it down. That way, if you all do do a video, or or post or whatever you want to do, if you if you want to do it, you don't have to. Do it. I'm just saying, if you want to do it. And that way you've got a good picture to use of the pipe because I know, you know, people seeing the pipe. I'm a professional hand model. No, I, no, I'm going to set it, no. Here, well, here's what we're going to do. I'm just going to turn this around like this. I'm going to turn this down. Yeah, I'm just going to turn it down. Put it, no, no, no. I want to set it right here. Now, give me that, give me that, uh, give me that, uh, yeah. yeah, give me the bag. Can you give me one of them filters? Uh, nope. No, I'm not going to do it like that. I think it'd be best like this. Just give me a second. I can zoom in. Give me a second. I think it'd have more light over here. Yeah, I think that's a little bit more light. Let me put it in the center so it's centered. There you go. I'll flip it over just in case some of you are wanting a picture on this side or think that side's prettier. I'll let you decide. Here, let me pull it off. I should do this too. Pull it off that. Move this out of the way. Now I'll flip it on the other side. Now that way all you have to do is you want to do a picture or something like that. If you want to do a picture or something like that, then uh, all you have to do is just fast forward to the end of the, uh, the, the Stumbo's Family Gathering and you can screenshot it. And, and, and that way it's there. That way you got a picture if you do a video or whatever. But uh, thank you all again for everything. I appreciate it. I love you. I can't tell you nothing else. I'll call it. Okay, baby. I love you. I love you. Thank y'all. Y'all have a good week, and I hope nothing bad happens to nobody. I hope everybody has a wonderful week. I hope you're smoking the blends that you love and the pops that you love or the cigars you love. Thank y'all ever for every single thing. Uh, I love you. Bye-bye.